Okay, what we got next? Hmm. Another bunker? I think we'll pass on that one. Let's see what else we can do. Uh, help to clean a big house, please. After the death of my beloved wife, I sold our old house. As it brings back so many memories that I cannot cope with, I've decided to buy a new house and require some and it requires some work. It needs cleaning and new radiators. It's too much for me and I don't have the strength. I would like to move out of my old house as soon as possible as it's too painful to live here. My two daughters will be living with me and would like their room to be painted with their favourite colour. Light blue. Please try to arrange everything quickly. Well bitch, I'm gonna take my time, whether you like it or not. End of story. Oh dear god, like, if you just come in here, and, like... Clean up the trash, Jesus. Or, arguably you did move house, so... I'll let it slide. It's not the worst one I've seen, so alright. Woo, fancy. We are going to make these bedrooms look absolutely fabulous. Okay, I can understand the trash and stuff like that like this, because if you're moving house, yeah, you're going to get so many boxes. So this is accepting. Very accepting. And it's not so bad. See? Just a couple of boxes. Okay, so we'll start with this room. So we paint first, then we decorate. So, uh, paint with sleepy blue. Sleepy blue. Sleepy blue. Uh. Right. One, two, three. And then we paint, and it will look beautiful. I mean, to be fair, this is actually quite chill when you do this sort of thing. And it's great. Oh, there we go. Again though, it would be very stressful in real life. Because it's not just painting it, you gotta get it. You gotta get the wall right, you gotta get the proper paint on. Is the colour different, which it is when you buy it. Because you're like, ah, oh, that's a very good blue and stuff like that. When you put it on the wall, it's like, what is this? What did I buy? I bought an abomination. Not a pretty abomination, a bad abomination. But no matter, it is still paint. And then you get used to it. That's literally the painful part of painting. You're not going to get the colour you anticipated. Unless you're a paint mixer, then you get every colour you want under the sun. But it is getting better though, because... We've got like paint machines and such, so we can make the colours to our own preference. But the thing is, when we put it on a wall, it changes. Because it's mixing with it. Because you've got things like the sunlight and such, which change the colour. You've got the moon as well, which darken it. I think. Not entirely sure. Not permanently, just when you look at it. So sometimes you just have to get a flashlight and go, Oh, that's alright. I can tell that the colours actually mix, but it's not working together, but hey! There we go. And always, 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 when you are, if you are getting like a room ready, paint first. Dear God, I've seen people, uh, what's it, decorate and then paint. It's a nightmare. Take everything out, then paint. Otherwise you're going to get paint all over stuff. And if you're in like a new house with no radiator and stuff like that, again, paint first. That is the number one thing you focus on first in a room, is paint. Or if you don't want to paint it, then fine, decorate it as much as you want. But if you're going to, paint first. Uh, we did paint the sleepy blue. You want more? No, no, we're good. Okay. So we get rid of that. Clean the dirt. Clean the dirt. 
Oh, look at this, lovely. See, that's what I want, just, just so you can see it better. Because this is seeable. So you can easily see the dirt and go like, okay, that's fine. What else do we need? Mount devices. Okay, so now we need a radiator. Radiator. Beautiful. And then you. Oops, I made a leak. That'll do. Place object bed. Okay. Uh, bed? Solid? There you go. Oh dear god, what is this? Oh, oh, oh my. I would not be able to sleep on that. At all. My feet would just stick out immediately. <laughs> now we need the desk, so... A computer desk. Not that they actually say that. But they don't. There we go. Then we need an office chair. A chair. Where is the office chair? There it is. I think that's cream. And we've got to have a diagonal. Wardrobe? Charles, there you go. This is so Ikea stuff. But I'm not going to complain. It's like the names, I can tell with the names. Chester, yeah, Chester draws Mal. It's like, I know they tried. Uh, I'm just going to put like the chest of drawers here. It's not a bedside table. Wow, is that it? Okay. If that's what she wants, that's what she wants. We do not question their judgement. Clean the dirt. Uh, clean the dirt. Oops, I'm up there. There we go. Now we should clean the window. Woo! This is nice. This is a nice one because you can just decorate it to like their preference. What we've got around here? More sleepy blue. Oh, fussy. She did say both want sleepy blue. That's fine. There we go. Open the windows so thieves can get in. Is that all of them? There you go. Like I say, I was like, what? That's all gone. It was there before and it went for me. Sleepy blue. I'm going to say just, just three is fine. If not, we'll just sell them. So it doesn't really matter. Here we go. More sleepy blue. And to be fair, it actually looks quite nice. Like, I won't lie, this is a nice shade of blue. That makes me want to fall asleep. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not that bad. That doesn't make me want to fall asleep. But it is very good. Like, we've only just learned that we can... We have different attributes or emotions with colours. Very clever. Like for green is like a peaceful colour, blue is a calming colour. Red is, uh, what's it? I think it's an enthusiastic colour, but I'm not entirely sure. I think it was orange. 
Like it's still unconfirmed, but it's clever how the brain works between colours and such. Like we even react to music. So if we get an intense music, oh yeah, of course we're gonna go for it. We're gonna go wild. Because we follow the music. And if it's calm and peaceful or something like that, like a river flowing, then we're going to relax, take a chill, maybe go for a walk while listening to it. It's clever. And it's still unknown for us on how it works. We just know it does. There we go. Look at this, this looks wonderful. Uh, really? We're out of paint? Oh yeah we are, sorry. Look at that. Let's just paint that across. There we go. Oh no, no. Beautiful. What, 99%? You're about. We had a hundred. What are you talking? There we go. What are you talking about? You want a bed as well? Jesus, God, so fussy. Uh, we'll paint two at a time. Demolition. Uh. That's not really a fuss. I'm just going to say faster building. Faster the better. Now we just need a solid bed. Says we still got dirt as well. Like here apparently. There we go. Mount devices. Now we just need a radiator. Same as what that other one wanted. There you go. Beautiful. Best radiator I've ever seen. And we've ranked up. Um, I'm gonna have... Faster tiling. No idea, but it sounds really rough, so... Uh, you want an office chair, obviously. Because that would shut you up. You also want a desk. There you go. And you want it near the sockets, I know for a fact. Wardrobe Charles. Charles? Gives me at the wardrobe. It's not like she's got one there. Now we've got Mel. Uh, damn it. Chest of drawers. Oh, Mel, sorry. Not Mel. Let's put it like there. Woohoo! Done. What we got in here? Clean the duct, clean the window mount devices. Awesome. Ain't so bad. Clean all the windows because they're filthy. Like, jeez. My god. Filth central. Now we need a towel radiator. 
mountable tower radiator. Screw, cap, screw, cap, screw, screw, pipe, screw, screw, twist. Beautiful. Oh my god. I think all these are done. Just need to do this one. It's not painting, is it? No, no, just cleaning. Okay. That's fine. Cleaning I'm happy with. Just wave my magic brush around. There we go. Radiator. Beautiful. And now we clean the window. Perfect. Uh, and clean down here. A bit of the windows, the floors, the walls. Can we just get rid of this? No. Well, it's in my way, so it's, it's just gonna go there. <laughs> it's in my way, dude. Move it. There we go. Clean the windows. Find the windows to the walls. Perfect. Look at this. Marvellous. Open all the windows so more thieves can get in. Not that there's anything of value in here. Anything else around here? Oh god, yeah, there is. Mount devices. Another radiator? Seriously? Another radiator? Goodness me, we do not need this many radiators, but fine. Apparently we do. And screw. Oh god, we've got a flood. Well, that happens. This is what happens when you sort out your plumbing system. Leaks happen. And then we've got one more bedroom. Paint with grey and royal blue. Ooh, this, this one's got mix. It's got a good colour mix. Can we sell the light? No. I'm not that kind of guy. I am! I'll sell everything. See? I'm being nice. I'm, let, I'm giving the thieves all the options here. There we go. And now we can open up the windows and clean. Uh, well, I'm breaking my own rules. I'm going to be installing a radiator first. Real life-wise, don't do it. Because then you have a nightmare. But I think game-wise, it's just going to go past them. So, we'll be fine. Paint with the colours grey and royal blue. Okay. Do we have grey? Grey, uh... Grey what? Just grey? Okay. We'll buy like three. And then royal blue. Royal blue. There we go. 
one, two, three. And I think we're gonna have it so, oops. We're gonna have it so we have full gray, but then we have blue along the edge. And I think that would look quite nice. See, look at this. That is a nice shit. Oh, no, 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 no. We don't want it to do that. So we're just going to paint along here. And along the windows here, we're just going to have blue. And it'll look nice. Because that, I think, is called abstract or two-toned. One of the two. Edge, edge two-toned. I don't know, but it will look good. Because you're adding the dark with a bit of a light. You don't want them working together. You want them to be next to each other, but you don't want them working together. Because it will clash too much. So you want a little bit of dark and a little bit of light. That's how you keep the balance. Uh, okay, so more grey around here. See? So you got grey and white here, but if we change up to blue, it has a better design. Right. Really? We're out already? I swear these don't last long. But eh, what can you do? Uh, okay, we get rid of that one. Get rid of this purple monstrosity. Goodness me. Way too much. This reminds me a little bit of the big brother house. Oops. Oh, no, 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 no. Like the colours. The colours do a little bit. I think I watched way too much of that. <laughs> People don't know what the big brother house is. I think it was celebrities that was allowed. And they were basically stuck in this house for day in, day out or whatnot. And they had to be the last one standing. I think. I think it was. And if not, they would be evicted out of the house if the people voted for it. And there'd be all sorts of challenges and such. To prove yourself and such, to stay in. And you had to be the last one. Yeah, it was just a bit of fun. That's all it was. There we go. See what I mean? That looks better. Because you've got style to it. And it's not too intense. A uh, little bit more blue, please. There we go. See? Okay, maybe we could have had it the other way around, but I don't know. Double bed Hermes. Hermes. There we go. Yeah, I've seen these before. Or have it in the centre. Right over the window where a thief can come in. Uh, Vera? Is it Vera? Yeah. Oh, goodness me. Definitely Ikea. Mal, so M A L. But we want the double chest. I know the colour's wrong, but pff, tough. Kim, no, is it Kim or Kin? Lim, sorry, no one here. Look, hashtag. Lim. There we go. Uh, we're just gonna, I'm just gonna stick it, like, here. Beautiful! Another one bites the dust. Awesome. Now, what have we got next? Uh, wow. Save me from these terrible colours, honey. Hello. Oh, hello, my dear. I'm so happy that you offered to help me with the house flipping. I hope your offer's still valid. 
You wouldn't say no to a wonderful person like me, right? Here's the deal. About a month ago, I moved to my cousin's house. She is, I'm sorry to say, an, an artist. Her artistic soul commands her to live in a house that looks like a Christmas tree. Oh my god, really? Because the wall's colours hurt my eyes, I cry so much that I can't stand them. Oh, I'm so angry that I'm afraid that the sour look on my face will give me wrinkles. That would be terrible. We have to do something with it. And you, my sweetie, have to help me with it. You need to repaint all these walls with the normal colours before my cousin returns from the tourney. Toned and quiet colours will be awesome. You know what I like. Wink, wink. Thank you for everything, heart, heart. And remember to hurry. Loves and kisses. Michael Brand. Dear God. Goodness me. Well, no problem, honey. We got you covered. Paint with the colours faded lemon. They're not that bad. I mean, I know what I know where he's getting from. It doesn't really fit well. Oh no, this will look better. That's got a good style for a living room. Oh no, sorry, not living room. Uh, hallway. Yeah, it does look better. Like Jay's, this artist really thinks it's so good. But I think not, because I can save you from these colours, honey. They'll all be fabulous. There we go. Now everything looks beautiful. And I don't want to get this horrible colour all over my nails. Like, jeez. There's so many problems today. And I have not got time for their shenanigans. So, get on with it. There we go, that looks better. Yeah, that does look much better. A nice faded lemon. Because you always want something that looks, uh, sort of this colour in a hallway. It's like a welcoming colour. Dear God, what is this? Oh my God. Um, I feel like I've gone into a beach house. Honey, I need to help you. It's, I wouldn't even pay you because it's hurting my eyes as well. Uh, sleepy blue. The sleepy blue? Yeah, it is. There we go. Paint. Get the gone monstrosity. Save my eyes too, like, jeez. Like, seriously. Let's just paint all this. There we go. I mean, you don't want full blue, depending on what, what your preference is, but sometimes two, maybe even three colours. It's always a good mix. Otherwise, one room with one colour is just basic. Unless that's what you want, then if so, go for it. Have fun, knock yourself out, etc. But if not, and you want to try something new, try two colours. Find out which ones suit your need. Everyone's got their different colours to their preference. Like mine is orange and blue. Or a little bit of red. Not in my bedroom. Jeez. There we go. Uh, can we just get some more paint? Yeah, we can. Cool. And then we're just going to paint all this. Pop 
Perfect. And then we're just going to... Oh no, we can't sell it. Okay, that's fine. We'll just leave it there. Nope, that's the outdoors. Anything else around here that needs to be saved? Bright peach, okay. What else have we got around here? Nothing down here? Okay. Whoops. You saw nothing! Oh dear god. That's a bit intense. Bright peach. Bright peach. Two of those. Yeah, these colours are way too intense. You, this, it clashes too much. Way too much green in here. It's a home, not a forest. So yeah, Peach will cl Peach will combat it. But it will work lovely with green. It's a nice healing colour. <coughs> it's a nice healing colour. Look at that. Awesome. Oh, if I can just get past. There we go. Jesus, these colours! Well, honestly, whoever painted this should go back to school. Because these colours, honey, do not go together. They are not happy with each other, and it just doesn't work. Like Cirrus Slayer. There we go. Uh, and then another pink. Where is the last piece? Is it around here? Hmm. I have no idea where the last bright peach is. It's not reassuring me. Oh no, we're good. There we go. Now we've just got the last one. Bright peach, same thing. Four of those should do. Not that I've actually used all four, but hey. Never know. Uh, what's it? Just use all that up. And then we just paint this. Where is... There it is. I see you hiding there, Mr. Fridge. Look at this. I mean, this sort of does clash, but I'm not really sure. What is this? White with a bit of dark? Yeah, that's too much. Not the lounge. Or living room, if you want to go that far. Let's put you here. Under the radiator. Or over the radiator, one of the two. Yeah, this looks much better. 
more style to it. Easy color makes you so perfectly. There we go. All the bright peach. Uh, oh god. Half done. No, we need to fix this. I cannot have a half done wall. It, it looks like someone smeared dark chocolate over it again. Who did it? Who smeared dark chocolate all over the wall? Shocking behaviour. Uh, pink and green. Look at that! Beautiful! Is that all of them? I mean, it says it is, but... It doesn't count. So let's just scan around. Usually it's these edge bits that have never been painted enough. There you go. 100%. 4,000 quid, Jesus Christ. Red is sexy. Yeah, you're not wrong. It's definitely sexy.